Hey guys, today I'm doing something a little different. I'm bringing you on vacation with me. Just kidding, I am on vacation. I'm here in LA. I just landed yesterday with my family for some good family time, a relaxing time, but I am taking the day to go visit some showrooms while I'm out here. I do know there are some more exposure to some of the international brands that I love so much. So I'm excited. I'm excited to see what these showrooms have to offer and what they have on the floor right now. Um, we're sourcing for a really um, exciting project um, that's very significant for us. We just signed on and we're so excited. So I want to get a head start on finding some inspiration and some new ideas and some fresh ideas. So come along with me to see what I can find. <laughs> And the contrast between like the matte finish, the metal finish, and then the lacquer, the shiny lacquer. Yeah. I mean, even when you're talking about modern and you're thinking you don't want to mix too much, but you see how much of an impact it does and still looks nice and clean, you know? I feel like that's my gospel. It's like talking about how modern can be warm and interesting. It doesn't have to be super stark and boring. Yeah, and it's cool because it, inside of the cabinets are finished as well because you get to see through it and then the glass shelves just make everything disappear so it doesn't look like some blocky lines you know through the glass yeah and i went back and forth between doing a gold finish on the bottom or this brass like this bronzy color i just love the contrast with the dark and the gold so i went with that this in a closet the house that we're doing with the builder right now and in my mind we we're gonna do it custom I didn't realize that somebody actually had it off the shelf so I'm gonna take a picture of that to show the client because we can probably just order from Ornari and have it ready-made see like it's got this angle so like it's a shelf like this whole thing's a shelf oh, I want this in my house too <laughs> Like in the master bathroom, master bedroom, there's gonna be a double door that goes into um, the bathroom and the closet on the other side. And Ornari is doing my closet, they're doing my kitchen, which is looking amazing. I'm so excited about it. And I'm thinking I need these doors too. <laughs> it's just unusual, even though they're sliders, they're unusual and they look so custom with the glass. How cool is that? So important to take pictures for me because the styling part of the project, I feel like it's a struggle for the team to understand what I like and what's in my mind. It's so like if I can bring this back, like the things that I react to, well, so I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so cool. Then they can see it and they can take that inspiration when they're pulling to accessorize our projects at the end. Obsessed. <gasps> wow, the whole thing. I mean, the system allows for that. See? This is why I love modern design. Uh, love uh, you know we we're just in Miami a couple weeks ago I was like man I love my job <laughs> like I get so excited to go see more stuff you know this is a good sofa for like a playroom media room it's just so cozy One of a kind, you can tell it was done individually.
is like the ultimate um, smart toilet. Well guys, I am really glad that I took the time out of my vacation to spend some time sourcing the showrooms and new lines because I did find quite a few gems out there. I did also get a chance to make a lot of connections with the vendors and the reps that are out here in LA. So it was very much worth my time. <laughs> The first showroom we ran into was quite a surprise. It's a vendor that I've seen at High Point Market, mostly. I don't think I've seen it anywhere else. I was not expecting to see them here in LA, and it was the first place I stumbled upon, and it was awesome. I got to see their line in person, a lot of the items that we've been specifying for our projects, that we've seen online and in pictures, but not really got a chance to see in person. It was awesome to sit down, experience the fabric, experience the feel, um, see the scale. I think scale is one of those things that you can't really get un until you see it in person and you see it in a space put together. Um, so we found a couple sofas there. I saw some awesome chairs that I had not seen before. And one of them I have seen on the website and sitting on it just really sold it for me. Not only is it sculptural and beautiful, but it was really comfortable. It has a swivel motion. Um, and the rep, rep there was super helpful and was able to pull stock, real-time stock um, availability on some of these items. So that's really important information I'm gonna take back to the team. We saw a nightstand that was gorgeous. I know it's one of their um, key pieces that they always have on their catalog. So I thought, Perhaps it was gonna be one of those pieces that are sold out and was gonna have a long lead time and turns out they have it in stock. So it's gonna be a, a, a lifesaver for us at this point. There's a couple projects that we source some furniture pieces that are a little too far out that we're gonna um, resource with some of those items we found today. So that was awesome. It was great to see Ornore. Again, Brazilian made, Brazilian built um, cabinetry. We got to see their showroom in Miami. We have a great showroom in Dallas, but it was awesome to see a different showroom with new pieces with an extension of their lines. They had some really cool contrasting leather accents and surprise, surprise, the same combination that I have coming into my kitchen in my home reno. So it was really cool to see the actual finish that I picked, the gold and the the walnut finished pulled together in one space so it really confirmed that i made the right choices and it made it even made me even more excited to see that coming to my kitchen in my house um, another thing i got to see there is a um, pot rack system or shelving system that hangs from the ceiling and it's actually very very similar to something we designed to go into a closet in one of our projects in dallas we're working with the builder and we designed this piece that was going to be a showstopper for the client and you know it's something that most builders are not going to be excited about sourcing because it's going to have to be custom made but it was nice to see it already installed at Ornare so I know now that I can give the client and the builder another resource where they can just go have turnkey exactly what we were expecting to give the client. <music> One of my favorite things about walking into a showroom is when I get to see multiple lines in one place. And that was the case today when we walked into this awesome space that had very beautiful European lines of upholstery, of case goods. It was gorgeous pieces. And as we got to explore the space, we got to see more and more um, special pieces. Not only do they have great furniture pieces that were very minimalistic and aesthetic and style, they were very much form follows function, very intentional, very clean. Um, we also got to see a lot of decor pieces, which you wouldn't 
necessarily imagine you'd find in a modern minimalistic showroom, but that is exactly what we saw. So everything that was there was special, was intentional, and the styling was on point. Since our specific aesthetic at Beyond Interior Design is really revolved around crafting a space that has got that modern luxury with an international influence, it's very, very important to me to continuously look for um, different vendors um, overseas that connects us to artisans and to different factories um, in Europe and all over the world. And I got to see today one place that pulled all those things together. Not only do they sell furnishings that are one of a kind, that are made to our specification, that gives us really quality, beautiful pieces in terms of stone, um, metal, and upholstery pieces. They also allow us to design an entire kitchen or a bathroom with bespoke pieces that are done overseas with a construction of an European kitchen cabinetry and they connect it all together so I could use different lines in one space and they will help us specify it all together and bring it all together so it was, it was really incredible to get to connect with those reps they gave us amazing service so that in itself was a big win for us today. I'm so excited I got to finally get into a bold concept showroom. It's been such a long time since I actually got to experience their showroom in person. It's one of those go-to places for me. It was one of the original modern design furniture showrooms that I got to connect with in Dallas in the beginning of my career. I know they always have you know, very specific pieces that are staples, that are affordable, and we can always incorporate into our projects. They are also individually owned. Every single showroom is individually owned here in the U.S. So it's very important for me to connect with um, a rep specifically to that showroom because every place is going to have a different stock list. So today I got to learn a little bit more about the showroom here and what kind of stock they keep um, in this location so that I can always email this rep and find out if she has something on hand that we can have right away because right now it is one of the biggest struggles in the design industry is chasing lead times and making sure that we have the items here on time for our clients for installation so it's great to make those connections and have that upper hand when we're sourcing things that we don't have to wait for it to come from overseas it's already here in, on the state site. <music> I got to visit the Kohler Experience showroom here, which was actually way bigger than what I had expected. They had a whole lot of their line on display, ready for me to see and experience. These were pieces that I got to see at NKBA pre-COVID, before you know everything was shut down, we got to see that, um, all, all the new lines. So it was great to reconnect and remember and be re-inspired by um, what they have available right now. It was great to see the new technology in smart toilets. I know it doesn't sound so exciting, but it is. You have to check it out. Everybody does need a smart toilet, I'm telling you. <laughs> um, also the connectivity between all of the um, faucets and sound systems and um, light therapy, aromatherapy, all of that good stuff, the minimalistic new lines that they have. It was really good to see that stuff in person because as designers, we get to see so many things, but we forget sometimes. We get to experience something one day and then the next day we experience something else. So it's very important to stay continuously inspired and in remembering what is out there for us in terms of lines and vendors. So that was really great to see. <music> So if you haven't already, subscribe below. Also comment on what your favorite showroom was, what your favorite pieces were. I'm really interested to hear your feedback and stay tuned for the next video.